Hola, good people, and welcome back to We Are The New Normal. I am Sam. Thank you for coming to see me today. So today, just want to speak briefly on something that was on my mind. Um, something that I guess I'm experiencing in my own life. And it is about faith. And it's not about faith from the perspective of any specific religion or any specific being but faith in I don't know faith in the natural order of things so what I mean is um, do you ever find yourself stuck in a process because you feel like you don't know the next step. Like, you're like, yeah, I want to, but I don't know what to do or how to, or so you kind of stay stuck because you just don't know what that next step is, or you're not sure, you don't have confirmation, or you have several choices and it just doesn't seem like you know which choice is clear to you. My advice in that instance is just move move forward with as much confidence as you have move forward in what you already know is the right movement and take that step having the faith that although you don't see that step down there when you take that step out the right step will appear so kind of think of it as a as a video game um it's like um you won't know what's on the next level until you reach a certain point so maybe things haven't been revealed to you because you haven't reached a certain point there is some more forward movement that you have to take on your own before certain things will be revealed to you. So just move. Just move. When you look back at your success, when you look back at how far you've come so so far, that's redundant, how far you have come, um, there were times in the past that you had no clue what your next step should have been, but you moved anyway. And somehow that right step just appeared underfoot. So, don't stay stuck. Move. Take a risk. Make a calculated hypothesis as to which direction at least you need to go. And trust that what you need to know will be revealed to you when you need to know it. Or when you're receptive to knowing it. There could be a lot of things that have been revealed to you and you didn't even see it because you just weren't receptive. You weren't in a place where it appeared to be what it was. Um, and I think I've used this, this, this story before that when um, Columbus arrived on the shores of America, the Native Americans did not even recognize the, the, the horde of ships in the ocean that was coming because their mind had nothing to pull from to let them know that what they were seeing was ships. So to them, they didn't see it at all. It took a wise shaman of the village to be able to see the ripples in the water because he also had nothing to pull from to see, to say, okay, that's a ship. Never seen a ship before, never seen anything in the water like that before. So he himself didn't even see the ships themselves. He saw the waves in the water that looked unnatural. So he knew something was out there. And as he dug deeper, he could see that they were ships. He didn't know what they were, but he warned the people. But because they had nothing to pull from in their head, because they had not been at that level to experience what a ship was, they didn't see what was right in front of their face. So take that risk. Take that step on faith. 
on faith that you know what whatever you have done thus far has got you this far you're still alive you're still smiling you're still pressing on have faith in that that you didn't know every step before you took it before and you're okay do it again this time not everything will be revealed to you before you take the step a lot of things you cannot realize until you take the step and get to that level where you can recognize what that step even was so my advice today is if you feel stuck have faith that if you put your foot out there the right step will appear underfoot and the uh gem i want to drop on you today is by gina davis and it says if you risk nothing you risk everything let that melt on your mind thank you for coming to see me today in my old natural glory i just came out here to try to enjoy the last little bit of sunlight on this monday um and to share what was on my mind so hopefully that will help someone today who might be stuck like me and contemplating their next move and feeling a little shaky and unsure take that step we're gonna take it together jump out on faith you've been caught before you'll be caught again so thank you everybody for coming to see me today i hope your monday was wonderful i hope the rest of your week gets even better as it goes along if you like this video, by all means, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, share these videos if you think it can help someone else. And by all means, if you would like to support this channel, you could hit the button at the top that says donate if you appreciate. So enjoying this little bit of uh, Indian summer. Um, you know, I enjoy my sunshine. So it looks like this winter might actually be short and spring might be on its way. I'm not complaining. So everyone, have a wonderful day, have a wonderful week, and remember, you are good people, have a good life.